Hi, this is Farhan and welcome back to another video. There are some videos out there which you really want to see and there are some videos out there which you don't want to see but you have to. And this is one of those second videos and that is talking about the price of XRP during this bear market. Basically looking at what is going to be the price prediction of XRP or how low can the price of XRP go during this bear market. Now, if you are a person who is in the world of crypto for a very long time like myself, you have seen these bear and bull markets, the cycle go on and on. Now, for those of you who are out there and this is your first time entering into an official bear market, well, things can be a lot scary. But in today's video, I'm going to make you realize that, hey, this is not that bad because in the long run, things are still going to be looking great. But obviously we have to talk about this time, this bear market and what the price of XRP is going to be because whether you like it or not, the past couple, the last couple of months have kind of made it official that we are in a bear market for the entire world of crypto, not just XRP, but the entire world of crypto. And if you have been following stocks as well, you might know that we are in a bear market for the world of stocks as well. So in today's video, we have a lot of very, very interesting things to talk about related to the price of XRP, the price prediction of XRP, and basically talking about the macro environment and when exactly is this bear market going to end. So stick with me until the end. Before going further, I just want to give a quick disclaimer that whatever I talk about in today's video, this is all my personal opinion and is not a financial advice. Whether we are in a bull or bear cycle, things can turn out very differently for XRP or any other cryptos out there. Anyway, having said this, now let's dive into the video and I just want to tell you guys that this video is going to be divided into two sections. The first section we are going to be talking about why exactly are we in this bear market and when do we get out of this? And second, we'll be talking about the XRP price prediction in later part of this video and basically talking about what other people are saying and what my own personal opinion is rela related to the price of XRP. Well, let's talk about what exactly is a bear market. Well, the official definition is whenever the S&P 500 index drops below the 20% from its all time high, that means we have officially entered into the bear market category. Well. As you guys already know, the world of crypto works very differently where a 20% drop doesn't really signify a major change. But if you look at the biggest crypto out there and that is Bitcoin, well, Bitcoin has dropped by more than 60% compared to its all time high, kind of like solidifying that we are officially entered into the bear market. Now, there are three major reasons. I'm gonna go through this very quickly, so not to bore you guys, but it is very important to know what exactly this is. Well, the first one is related to the interest rates, and that is worldwide banks, basically central banks all over the world, they have raised interest rates. And to give, even put it more simple, whenever the interest rate rises, the world of stocks drops and as you guys already know stocks are related to crypto they have a very strong correlation to their price that means the price of crypto drops as well so interest rates goes up stocks go down crypto goes down that's the first one second one is related to inflation as you guys already know worldwide the prices of a lot of commodities have really increased and whenever such thing happens people don't really have money to spend for investing this is why a lot of people they take out money from high risky assets such as stocks and whatnot and they kind of put into much safer assets and obviously a lot of people they don't have money to invest in crypto so this is why we also see another drop in crypto prices the third and final reason it is related to the war between Russia and Ukraine. That has had a major profound impact worldwide and that is also causing somewhat of a strong strong negative effect on the prices of crypto. So now we kind of have got an idea on what bear market is and why and what factors are causing it. So now let's look at when is this going to end? To give you the short and simple answer, I don't know and nobody else knows as well because nobody can exactly tell you when a bear market ends and definitely not another youtuber and especially definitely not that guy on twitter you have been following because nobody exactly knows but there are some factors which can contribute to a switching of the cycles between a bear and bull and well that is for a different video because that is going to be a very extensive one and i'll be definitely be making a video on that so make sure you're subscribed but there are two school of thoughts here the first one is talking about hey we are going to see uh, the crypto world entering into a bull cycle towards the end of this year because for the past many years the prices of cryptos they have done exceptionally go, uh, good uh, towards the end of the year but there are but there is another school of thought which says that hey we are in this for a very very long run and that is talking about multiple years so whatever the outcome is 
uh, I can say for sure that it is going to take some time before we enter into a bull cycle and unfortunately that is the reality on the ground. Now let's talk about XRP price prediction during this bear cycle and from now until the end of this video I'm simply going to refer to it as a bear cycle because they go through cycles such as a bear and bull and in a bull cycle we see the price of XRP or other cryptos go ma massively increase and in a bear cycle we see a massive decrease. Now, even though it might seem that the price of XRP or your other crypto which you have invested might never increase, but remember they go through these cycles and in the bear cycle, when we say XRP price prediction during a bear market bear cycle, what we're exactly referring to is how low can the price of XRP go during these cycles. And if you want to try to aim to buy at that point and when we eventually shift to a bear cycle, a bull cycle, you can get absolutely massive returns. Now, talking about XRP price prediction for this bear cycle, if you look at the past history, we have seen somewhat of 25 bear markets for XRP. The biggest uh, bear cycle, it has been, uh, XRP has seen a decrease of 79.6%, the second biggest at 79.4%, and the third one at 71.9%. So just by looking at these, now do keep in mind that these are simply past data which doesn't really reflect how it will happen in future. But if you are just looking at here, we see the XRP generally decreases between 70 to 80% during major, major bear, uh, bear cycles. And it seems that we are currently uh, in one. And if you're looking at the recent price, uh, the old time recent pr uh, price increase for XRP or recent uh, all time high for XRP, it was at around $1.38. And if it decreased that by around between 70 to uh, 80% we can expect that the price of XRP will go as low as around 0 0.28 0 0.29 dollars and currently the price of XRP it is trading at around 0 0.36 dollars so this is just giving you guys a basic idea based on past data on how the price of XRP might behave but keep in mind that it doesn't really reflect on how it will happen in the future but if you are basing on past data we can expect that the price of XRP will drop to as low as 0 0.29 to eight dollars during this bear cycle now another great tool to look at the bull and bear cycle is basically looking at the crypto fear and greed index now we are currently seeing the past one year for crypto uh, fear and greed index and as you guys can see pretty much whenever we see an extreme uh, extreme greed the prices are generally very high and this is highly highly correlated to the prices the fear uh, the, uh, the fear and greed index and as you can see we are somewhat towards the bottom where we are in pretty much in extreme fear and this kind of goes to show that hey we might actually see some out of a switch of cycles in the coming months and if you look at the max period here it kind of goes to show that hey we are actually in somewhat bottom compared to the history or whenever we started tracking that is basically first february 2018 we are somewhat towards the bottom of this fear and greed index and we which might kind of give us a signal that hey we have kind of reached the maximum bottom for this uh, bear cycle and as again as i mentioned the past data does not really mean that we can exactly give a good prediction for the future but this is somewhat of a good indication of in what direction we might be heading so again according to this uh, data we can say that hey we have we might have somewhat reached the bottom of this bear cycle for not just the price of xrp but for a lot of other cryptos out there that only difference now is hey uh, how long is this sideways momentum is going to last and when exactly is going to happen that switch in towards that bull cycle and only time will tell when that is going to happen next well guys that was the video for today and yes i know i have made a video after a very long time but guys expect a weekly videos from now onwards and very interesting ones too let me know what are your thoughts about this video and if you have any recommendations on what kind of videos you would like me to make well do drop a comment below and as always thank you for watching this and I will see you next time.